Hi, so I just got my hands on the new Samsung Galaxy Note 20 Ultra. It's the latest flagship model from Samsung. And I have to say, this phone is awesome. Stay tuned. Note series phone I ever had was the Note 4 and although that was an amazing phone I have gone through a few different phones since then with the latest model I own being the S9 Plus the Note 20 Ultra was a huge step up Nothing more exciting than buying a new product and breaking that seal for the first time. There's something exciting about it. One could never get over it. There's such a level of excitement to it. And here it is guys, the Note 20 Ultra, it's beautiful. So the camera bump on this phone is huge and Samsung was not subtle about it. Seeing it for the first time in store was shocking because it was sitting right next to the regular Note 20 edition and that version is a lot more toned down than this one. This phone features four cameras, a 10 megapixel selfie cam in the front and in the back from top to bottom, a 12 megapixel ultra wide camera, a 108 megapixel wide angle camera which is one of my favorites by the way and lastly a 12 megapixel telephoto lens which is great for taking pictures very far away So what else is in the box? Fast charger, super fast charger to be precise. Paired with a double-ended USB-C type cable, which is just over 3 feet in length. One hour and ten minutes. That's how long it took me to charge this phone's huge 45 milliamp hour battery, which can give you just over 12 hours of battery life with heavy usage and about 24 hours, not exaggerating with minimum use.
these are my personal numbers with my experience with the phone for about a week now and yes there is a lot of videos out there with different numbers but result vary based on his or her own experience with the phone and finally the S Pen one of the main feature of the Note series phone the S Pen is about 105 millimeter in length and weighs about 3 grams the pen itself has two physical buttons one at the top for removing the pen from the device and the other about halfway up from the tip for gesture controls the pen itself is bluetooth enabled and it has a lithium battery that gives it about 24 hours of battery life if this pen dies you can actually just plug it back in for about six minutes and it gives you one hour of battery life itself is water resistant and the pressure sensitivity has been improved to make writing feels as if you're writing pen to paper there's so much more that this pen and phone is capable of stay tuned for a follow-up where I highlight my top features so I said a lot of positive things about this phone but here are a few cons one the price this is an expensive phone two thousand dollars not many people are willing to dish out this type of money for a phone your only other option is to do a trading on your old device which samsung will give you two hundred dollars plus the value of your phone for you. second the size this is a huge phone coming in at 6.9 inch display this phone is gonna take up a lot of space in your pocket but that's what note phone is about if you're buying into the note series expect a large phone for me it's not a con it's a pro lastly the build quality this phone is all glass and although it has the toughest glass right now gorilla glass victus at the end of the day it's still a glass phone you drop it it will break and if it doesn't break it's gonna scratch crack and it's gonna be you who have to pay out of your pocket to fix it i would not take the gamble of dropping it put a case on it save yourself the trouble guys so that's it guys thanks a lot for watching this unboxing video and if you guys like the video just drop a like or subscribe catch you guys on the next one Thank you.